Hello everybody, it's Steve. Welcome back to Surviving Mars Below and Beyond. I am just turning these guys back on and guess what? They can still pull from the depleted deposits that are here. So I'm getting in an extra little bit of uh, machine parts. Not machine parts, rare metals. Yo, I got a rocket coming in from Japan. I actually am recording this one immediately after the last one. Now just grab the screenshot for the video and now let's go ahead and get our first diamond dome up and running. I gotta make sure it's inside the radius of all of these guys. So I think this is gonna be it, because there's my drone hub right there. Um, which are my first two domes. I'm actually gonna bring it down just a skosh. Yeah. I like that. I'm gonna hook up the water and power this way. Even don't have to, it's gonna allow me to uh, put down some extra tanks for stuff if I need to. Uh, this dome is going to require quite a bit of stuff, so most likely we'll do a tunnel over there. Probably going to put some stuff there. Also need, um, hopefully this is going to address the housing problem I have. Dust storm approaching. Aha, uh -huh. that's more power for me. It really just is. Working on Explorer AI right now, advanced Martian engines, lake crafting, lake vaporators. I'm kind of all over the place on technologies right now. Um... It's going to work. It's one of those things that, like, this is going to have to be a bit of a hodgepodge for a little while to make sure this stuff all works correctly. Oh, we need to turn you guys on and max you out. We're at, okay, very high quality. So we're able to pull 14 metals per day out of this. And I'm sending a lot of it upstairs, which is fine. Um, I do actually need to get a waste rock processor down here. I'm gonna set this behind the. I'm gonna set this behind the elevator. We're gonna need metals and machine parts for it, and it's gonna turn the waste rock that I'm producing, all of this, into usable concrete. So it's gonna Dust be helpful for approaching. me. And for this dome, let's see. We've got the concrete. We've got the metals. We've got the. Ooh, we don't have the polymers. I'll be damned. Um, we do have quite a bit of space with which to put more polymer factories down. I'm gonna pack you up. I'm gonna build another one of you right there. We're going to double up on some of these advanced things, because I've got plenty of fuel right now. It's more a matter of making sure they're being put to use. So, I'm going to pack you up, please. Perfect. We're going to slap you down next to this guy that is, I'm, I'm queuing up. Perfect. Neat. All right. Polymer blades are getting installed on everything right now, so we're at 21 plus percent. And all of these guys are full. I've got a lot of excess power right now. Um, we need to make sure these guys are at full range to make sure we're covering everybody. Yep, 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 yep. This one's barely being covered. I'll be okay with that one having to get maintenance sometime. But let's get some MDSs in here too. And the MDSs are going to kind of be... I've got... Alright, I've got one up there. That's okay. There's, it feels like there's going to be a gap in the grid, but I'm going to address that with this guy right there. Yeah, that'll work. So a lot more metals going out the door. Thankfully, the underground site is going to help us build that. I'm also going to order up some more atomic accumulators. Having extra power capacity available to me obviously is going to be very good. Especially, again, I don't know what the disaster is yet. It could be if it's spheres, which I don't think it is, because I haven't seen anything for it yet. I haven't gotten... It's not Philosopher's Stone. I would have seen that already. Haven't seen... Yeah, because spheres I would have already seen. Philosopher's Stone would have already been visible. Metatron might show up soon, if that's the case. Dredgers would be another event, would be another mystery that could show up soon. Um, wildfire might show up soon. If that's the case, I'll have to make a, a farm dome very quick. I could do one kind of up here to make that happen. Um, hmm. I'm trying to think what else mystery... So wildfire last war uh, could be one we get also. We could end up getting a hard mystery on this one. I'm, I'm thinking about that, and I didn't, and I did pull this 
concrete extractor out after it went bust. I probably should have kept it around. It would have been a smarter play for me to do so. What are we doing on drones here? We're getting stuff uh, brought down pretty slowly. It is telling me, yeah, I do need to get more shuttles built up. And I do think... There's a spot right here that could do well for shuttles. Also right here. There's no mining in this area. Let's, uh... Let's do something here. Yeah, we're going to squeeze three more shuttle hubs in here. Um, the only fuel supply is going to be right here at this depot. So it's going to be one of those things. I mean, you know, this fuel, this refinery has been running full for a while. It makes sense. Really, you're heavy. Interesting. Uh, I guess it kind of makes sense. Wow, yeah, we are we need to start offering something that's not polymers. Or just switch us back to a straight landing pad. Could offer trades up for myself and get other things. Let's see what we're doing down here. Most likely this guy waiting on con Yeah, he's waiting on waste rock to be done up. We only have a handful of drones down here. Yeah. I do Dust think we're going to need to bring up... I was aware of that dust storm. It, for some reason, it just caught me by a surprise yet again. We're going to bring up another 20 drones. I, do I, even, I don't think I have drone assembler tech. No, I don't. It's right here. I'm going to keep outsourcing because I've got the cash for it. Um, once I've got it all, and it should be okay. But the polymers that I have here, I'll hopefully... You know what? Let me turn off the diamond dome for a second. Let's get these extra shuttle hubs going. I think it's going to help uh, alleviate some of the pressure, too. Waiting on metals here. Okay. Yeah, there's one downside with this part of the colony. There's no metals here. Unless I opt for a molehole mine, which I don't think I've actually researched yet. No, I haven't. Molehole mine is right here. It's only 17,000, mind you. I've, I've waited this long on advanced Martian engines. I think I could wait a little bit longer on getting advanced Martian engines. Omega, uh, putting the molehole mine right here and getting that essentially unlimited supply of metals and rare metals will be helpful. The rare metals obviously to fund the colony. The rare metals... No, reverse that. The metals. To build the colony, the rare metals to fund the colony. And also, you know, make electronics. That, that's kind of a good thing, too. But we'll make sure these guys get built up. There we go. We got our first one going in. I will go ahead and I will authorize a, a single fuel storage down here. Don't get me wrong, I'm not big on having them down here. I will authorize 40 fuel here, and um, I need to get compact hangers, most likely. I think it'll be something I need to get my hands on relatively soon. Polymers are running very low right now. What's my consumption on them? Hmm. Uh, you. Where are you? Up here? Come on. I've got time to get this stuff built, which is okay. Tons of excess power. A lot of excess research. Just saying. Alright. Grab these polymers here. I could also do polymer production down here. Again, not a terrible idea. I can put the fuel stores down here. I can, you know, make plenty of fuel, bring it up, and utilize it up here. Let's go ahead and dump that off over here. Yeah, going to request a ton of polymers, ton of electronics to get done. I've got all of it available, so we'll make it work. Um, we are waiting for electronics to resume here. Are there electronics over here? Seriously? Yeah, I guess they are. I think like 30... Why? I don't know why. We're kind of like... Who, we're, the, we're not getting a good balance on stuff. So like 15 here, I guess? Concrete, 30 metals, yeah. Need to work on some balancing for these things too. Th this I'm just gonna keep getting this event until the waste rock is uh, appropriately resolved. Because I'm getting waste rock stored up here. I'm getting metals stored up here. It's just gonna take time for it to get you know cleared. I haven't unlocked storages yet. They are there, right here. 
There's the compact hangers and shuttle speed upgrades too. But I want to get Explorer AI done up. And then probably get underground shuttle hubs operational too. Another reason to actually produce that stuff underground. This works. I've got one soul four. All this stuff can be brought in. I can build all the shuttles that I need for it. It's just gonna essentially just take a little bit of time to get the materials in place, and I'm gonna be fine. Right, Vega 1 cannot land at this time, that's okay. Lots of buildings offline, that's okay. Just confirm that everything's okay. Move that over there. Heavy, I'm pretty sure this heavy load, yeah, it's right here on this main drone hub that's covering the bulk of the production side of the colony. We've got most of these guys built. Wow, we're just waiting on polymers. Not surprised. All right, you know what? Let's make it happen downstairs. Let's make fuel production happen downstairs. Um, also, hey, you four drones, I'm assigning you to the... No, 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 Batman. Assign you to the elevator. Slight problem. I now would... Um, get the hell away. I'm not doing the bomb again. I've done the bomb before. It's not fun. All right, so now we've got some research coming in from our explorers. We're going to get 180. Uh, we're going to get 90... Or 180? 180 from explorers. 100. Okay, yeah, because we've got two. Right down here. I've done the bomb event in the past. It doesn't end well. Um, pretty much if you allow them to use the bomb, you're going to get like a meteor storm and another dust storm on top of each other. It, it, they're not, I'm not a fan of it. I've done it in the past. Just uh, doesn't do it for me. Right, I need drones. I do have a drone assigned to you. Let's go ahead. Oh, I'm going to assign two drones to the elevator. We go downstairs. You two. I've now been assigned to this elevator. Now I've got five drones here. That works. I'm sending a bunch of metals upstairs. Fine. I uh, need to get... You have nobody assigned to you. Perfect. Just need to see what's out this way. I'm going to clear that when we can, please. Cable out this way. I'm going to put the fuel stuff on the back side of this. Just so we can get polymers produced, uh, fuel produced, and shuttles. Which is telling me I also need to get underground shuttles. Wow. I'm sorry, you take you only cost three thousand to do? Oh, done. Alright, fuel tanks. Large fuel tank over here. Yeah, we're good on that front. Water, how are we doing on water? We're actually doing pretty good. We actually still produce more if the situation called for it, which it kinda does. Well, it will call for it once this diamond dome is done up. We seriously just not... Oh, it just doesn't function, period, during storms. Well, that's just dumb. I brought everything over there, and there's no reason to actually deliver the materials it needs. Okay, it is actually building the extra shuttles we need. Perfect. We can, uh, we can use this. I'm getting the supplies delivered up there. Oh, I forgot to... Whoops. Oh, turn you back on, please. I totally forgot about that guy. You have 31 assigned to you? Let's uh, drop that by... Right, let's make it 25. How about that one? Now over here. Put you here. Where's my RC Seeker hiding out? You've just been chilling over there. Cool. Come back over here now. Come back over here. Yeah. And you're over here. Gotcha. Close up. And then we're going to move you to the elevator. Yeah, immediately this thing was going to have a, uh, a heavy drone load just because of how this thing is right now. High-speed comm satellite would do well for me. The only mission we have is Swan Lake, and I don't have any geologists, as far as I know, being produced. We're actually getting scientists made. Nice! Complete. Right, underground flight school. That's what I was talking about, getting the technology down there. Done. Yeah. Alright. 
Let's get a medium fuel refinery down here. Actually, build this a little bit further out. Build those three kind of next to each other. You unpack your drones, please. Okay. All you drones. Assign you to the elevator. You three drones. Assign you to the elevator. That's my last drone. I'm assigning you to the elevator. Cool. Wanna make sure the elevator's got a little bit of drone uh usage. Plenty of real estate for me to work with on this. And I'm going to send this guy down this way. Is there anything else down here I need to explore? I don't think so. This does also give me more space to build out. So I can get fuel done up. I've got most of the materials, actually, to build these. Um, most. I don't have a lot of con... I don't have enough concrete for this yet, but I'll get there. And my co-pilot trying to make this a short nap. Come on. Roll back over. There you go, kiddo. Ugh. Hold your breath for a second on that one. She has been cranky today. All right. We're good on that front. Let's get. Let's actually get a scrubber down here. Uh, yeah, put a scrubber right there. I'm gonna be able to use that to. They're okay on that front. Alright. Lots of extra power. We're good on that front. My Hockey Institute is in an overnight shift, so she's not operational. That's okay. A lot of homeless colonists, so let's turn this guy back on. Don't have enough metals for this. Don't have enough polymers for this. Do have enough concrete for this, so I got that going for me. This might be the time. Oh, homeless is the problem here. Um, Arcology? Nope. How much is an arcology to unlock? 7,500. Only 7,500. It's a day to get this operational. I'm not 100% in agreement with what I did there, but I do think it's an option to kind of continue to encourage the growth of colonists. Because if I'm not getting colonists that are born, they can't be filling in these uh, structures. So I've really got to push for these people to, you know, continue to be happy. And if that means building a giant apartment complex for them, I will build a giant apartment complex slash arcology for them. I could also turn this project off and refund a bunch of the materials I need for this. Just throwing that out there. I'll shut that back down. Run back downstairs because he's most likely... No, not things I need to worry about. You're offline because of storage space? Super. I built a storage for you guys. There we go. They're out of excuses now. Um, we're waiting on machine parts. I have machine parts. What the hell? Okay, we are allowing fuel here, which is okay. I'm going to need 28 concrete down here. We'll make it work. These drones are just going to be busy for a while. That, that's really just the long and short of it. Got 41 drones here. They're still on a medium... Wow, still running on a medium tack. Let's bring it down to 35 and bring it up to 20 here. I don't think they're destroyed. That was a bit odd. Huh. Outsourcing is decreasing, which is fine. That was just really weird that I had two drones that I said, yep, they were destroyed, but they were in fact fine. Maybe the Cold Machines event is still acting up in the game, because we did have that earlier, and it didn't, it wasn't actually happening? I don't know if you recall that, I think it was episode two. 
that that instance happened that in we had that instance not gonna fit there I want you to fit right there be in range of this guy I could probably bring him in just a little bit the sterling general beater will be included on this but we'll still be able to produce as much as we can here consumption is uh, it's pretty high Gotta make sure we're utilizing that. Expand your radius. So to cover these guys too. Yeah. Okay, for some reason I saw 10. It... I feel like I've had a long day. I've been up for... I've, this is the third video I've recorded. I've recorded Mondays and Tuesdays. Now this is Wednesday's video, if I'm not mistaken. Just for some reason I feel like I'm not... Uh, I'm not firing on all cylinders this morning. It's, or this afternoon. It's a bit odd now. Our college is almost done. What I'm probably going to do is refab one of these living complexes and put in another Hawking Institute here just to make sure that I've got more research going. The people here, wow, they are missing a lot of stuff. Wait, you have shopping here. I'm confused. What are you missing here? Not spot the resources. Okay, shopping, relaxation. There's a research what? complete. That does not make a lot of sense. Okay, arcology in here, please. Uh, I'm just gonna take a bunch of concrete, a bunch of polymers. I am gonna beeline this one. Let's go ahead and get this thing built, please. Ah, I totally forgot. There's a there's a universal depot hiding back here. Did not realize it was there most of this whole time. So we can get a lot of this stuff built up. Artificial muscles technology hasn't been located yet. If I can locate that, which I'm hoping to do soon, um, we can definitely utilize that. Let's go ahead and pack up this living complex. Let's refab it. And in its place, get another hockey institute up. Boom, and full. I'm also going to change the skin on it, because I like this one the most out of the three, so I'll keep that one up and running. Now we'll get a Hawking Institute done up. That's going to be popular with these folks. Hopefully this will... Hopefully this got rid of a lot of the homeless penalty, and that's going to actually get Near it into a point. Incoming. Show me. Remember when I said that was going to happen? It happened. Now, here's the big problem. There was no power in this section. None. I moved all of it upstairs. So, these dome... So, these buildings are all... Oh, yeah, I forgot about these four wind turbines. Everything else is pretty much on critical mode at this point. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to have to build another drone hub. Right here. There's going to be some spots we can mine, but also I do need to keep this tunnel up and running. I had a feeling it was going to happen. I'm guessing it happened down here because the MDS up there doesn't look like it had come online. We got our uh, network node prefab. That's okay. We'll go ahead and make sure we've got extra people working. We are going to get a collaboration loss, 10% loss on this because we've got two of them now. But we are actually training more uh, scientists, which will go towards our goal here. We'll get a new rocket if we get 50 Martian-born scientists. We'll get three genius applicants if we get 20 scientists. And our scientists, our genius colonists, we've lost one of them. Because we had 11 come down initially. I said I was going to stop with the outsourcing. And here I go, just keep outsourcing more and more. Let's go ahead and get this done up. I'm going to order up a Universal Depot. Let's go there. No food, no fuel. Let's make this like 8. By 8, I mean 10. And hopefully these drones will work on getting this tunnel back up and running. 
Oh, excellent. Research there was some sort there was some materials here that we could use. Guys, get back to work. Oh shit. A bunch of it just got delivered. I'm guessing it came from up here. Molehole mine is done. We've lost power down here completely. Yeah, these guys got completely taken offline. We'll make it work. And definitely gonna slap down another MDS up here to particularly uh, defend this section of the grid. I knew it was gonna happen. It's just a matter of when. Chekhov's tunnel. Is that a uh, thing like Chekhov's gun? Yeah, these guys are completely flat. All right, here we go. Power's back being restored. Really? It seems like it was more than uh, that far completed. All right, I'm gonna turn you guys back on. Turn you guys back on. Turn you guys back on. We're gonna be okay. I'm not worried about it. Boom. Problem solved. Grid's now got enough power. We're charging everything back up. Essentially, we just had a brownout. Hey, it's like Texas. Texas has had its problems this summer, okay? Not to mention the water problems. Living here, I get to say these things. All right, let's go ahead and get these guys up and running. Mm, yeah, I'll go ahead and allow the construction on all three of these guys. Let's go ahead and get a rocket. Oh, wait, I can build one here? Yeah, I can. Oh, right, I'll be damned. Cargo rocket. Just bring a shitload of drones up. Because realistically, the drones are being paid for with the exports back to Earth. Okay, AME is being researched now, finally. Let's work on getting the molehole built. I think right here is a good spot for it. Molehole mine is going to take 400 concrete, which I don't have, 100 metals, which I barely have, and 300 machine parts, which I don't have either. But if I put it right about here... Nothing else is going to be built out this way, so it doesn't make sense to not build it somewhere where it's, you know, not going to be used. If that makes sense for folks, like, th there's nothing else that's going to go here. But if I run downstairs, I'm looking for metals and machine parts. There's a lot of fuel already. We're waiting on electronics down here. Where are my electronics down here? I need a hey hey down here as soon as possible. You! Let's go. Just because it says you have those parts, it doesn't mean you actually have them close by and available to you. Go ahead and collect that all. And I believe that hey hey is on automated mode. If he's not, I'm going to go ahead and put him on auto mode. We'll get him set up. We're going to get those underground shuttle hubs built. And, oh, well, since I'm here, I'm just doing a lot of back and forth, back and forth. Hopefully you're okay with this. And if you have any photosensitivities, I apologize. Go ahead and... Okay, I do need exotics for this. But... That's right, I can do georeactors too. That's a ton of extra power also. A drone hub. Right about here, maybe? No. I don't want to put it here-ish. Yeah, about there. I'm just going to start prepping stuff. Because I'm going to build out here. That's right. Gonna queue that up too. And I can actually run power all the way around to this if I want to. I kind of do. But collapses in the cave systems will cause problems. Did you go get them? Oh my god, did he seriously go grab the wrong thing? Hey, hey, you. I think you did. I, really, I think you did. I think you brought food back. I expect nothing less from Hey Hey. I really don't. Here's this one cost eight concrete, but these two cost ten. It's an observation. Resources are low. Yeah, they are. Um, let's get an outside ranch going. No, I don't. Resources so don't need an outside are low. ranch. 
Meteor shower incoming. Man, it's all coming down on me today. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna do machine parts for food. Because that's the only thing I really have to spare at this point. It, I'm feeling, it feels like I'm coming apart at the seams at the moment. We're getting stuff sent upstairs as fast as we can. Wow. Okay, India. I'm totally on board with this idea. Can you get a bunch of machine parts loaded up, please? How many do I have here? Not a lot, but I'll use them. We'll grab machine parts off this guy. Well, on the plus side, we have used all of the metals that we can for this. I do think that the lack of basic, a lot of basic materials, I do, I'm aware of this one right here. Um, I'll be able to fill up the rocket pretty quick because this guy's going to be coming in here. I'm at the 30 minute mark, I'm aware of that. Let's get this rocket filled up and then I can very quickly turn around and offload the food from it with my, uh, with my hey hey. And hopefully get some shuttles going here. We can unload straight onto the rocket. It wants its 50. I'll give him the 50. And I can turn on and unload the 200 food. And hey, hey, continuing to be useless, brought over the wrong thing yet again. I'm actually going to follow him this time because it seems like he's Meteor just really trying to be coming. stupid as much as possible at this point. Okay. There's a big pile of electronics. Please grab all of them. I think it grabbed the polymers and it grabbed the food. It didn't grab the freaking thing I asked it to. Thank you. Please drive home. Meteor this is why it's hey hey. It is too stupid. The, the amount of stupidity from this thing is shattering. Also, I think I just shattered how much food supply I have because I don't because I've got way too much food now. I'm, wow, Resources I'm out of everything else. I'm completely out of everything else. I'm out of machine parts. I'm out of electronics. Um, you're you're off for some long reason. It's gonna take a while to get this uh, all back up and running, but I do think the mobile mine is the way is one of the ways that we're gonna get this done. We have to invest like parts that we don't have. Like considering that I just traded a bunch of food here, I very easily and actually I'm going to I'm gonna turn around and I'm gonna trade food. Or something else. In fact, let's Dust go ahead and build a trade pad. Wow. Game. Try to kill me less, please. Alright. I'm at the 30 minute mark. We're doing dangerous at this point. Because I don't have a bunch of stuff going on here. Let's go ahead and turn off food and fuel at this location. I'm going to have the rest of it go. I don't see many cave-ins over here, so I could definitely get away with just cables and pipes all the way over to this to hook everything into the grid. That's Meteor a good sign. Shower incoming. I'm out of machine parts. I'm out of concrete. I'm out of metals. But I've got plenty of food. Resources are low. So let's actually offer food for concrete. We'll see what we get, and then I'll wrap up. There we go. Rush will give me some. I'll use that. That's going to help me get the mohole mine built up. These two guys are actually using the metals that I'm getting from downstairs to make machine parts, so there's a fine balance that has to be found and maintained, which I've yet to do. Go ahead and drop off those over here, please, because I do have a little thing over here. I'm training colonists. I've got vacant residence slots, but I also have a lot of available jobs. Let's actually close shifts here. To actually solve a lot of the problems by just putting the TV studio workshop off and kind of just refocusing people into other positions where they need to be working. Alright. Okay, I was looking for available job slots. I need to put a cut in here. Like, comment, share, and subscribe Research if you enjoyed this video and all the videos that come out on this channel. Holy crap, Advanced Martian Engines are finally done. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.